I purchased a Verizon jetpack to provide internet access to our house. I'm very happy with it so far, but it is limited to 10 simultaneous connected devices and doesn't have any Ethernet cable ports for connecting non-wireless devices to it. That wouldn't work for what I want to do at my uh, house with my internal network. And so I want to show you how I created a network bridge to share the Jetpack's network connection across my home network. Here is a schematic of what I am doing. The Verizon Jetpack will connect to the internet. For the purpose of demonstrating this, I'm just going to use a Macintosh laptop as my network bridge. It connects wirelessly to the Jetpack. I use an Ethernet cable to connect the laptop to an Apple Airport Extreme. From there, I can have numerous devices connected wirelessly to the airport, or using Ethernet cables, I can connect non-wireless devices like personal computers in my kids' rooms. To do this is very easy. Open the System Preferences on the Mac, and under Internet and Wireless, click on Network Sharing. From the Network Sharing window, click on Internet Sharing and share your connection from drop-down. Set that to Wi-Fi. In the Two Computers Using area, select the checkbox next to Ethernet. Now select the checkbox next to Internet Sharing to turn on Internet Sharing. Now your Verizon Jetpack is bridged to your Airport Extreme and you can share the network connection. For more videos like this, please visit GearTV.com.